hey guys welcome back to my channel chelsea j here today we're going to be doing a soft bronzy natural glam okay yeah all of that in one if you want to see how i achieve this look make sure that you keep on watching if you're new here sis thank you so much for coming by make sure that you subscribe so that you can join the family because we're growing over here girl and we want to make sure that you keep up with the looks okay so make sure that you subscribe if you're not new thank you so much for coming back to my channel so make sure that you share some comments so that we can chit chat in the comment section and yeah let's just go ahead and get into the video sis hey guys welcome back to my channel chelsea j here if you're new welcome to my channel girl and if you're not new thank you so much for coming back and um just chilling and doing your makeup with me so i've already started on my brows for some reason this side right here is a little bit you know a little bit crazy so we're gonna even it up once we finish so don't pay attention to that it's gonna be perfectly fine girl i promise so let's just go ahead and get into the face um so today we're gonna be using of course the milk makeup um hydro grip primer this primer is bomb y'all gonna get tired of me talking about it because i say this in every video girl it is so bomb you need this in your collection and thank you guys so much for showing so much love on my last video i really do appreciate it um and thank you for giving me suggestions if you did so next i'm going to go in with the laura mercier um this is their blurring primer i'm not sure if you guys all of that so i like to um apply this before um after i put on my milk hydro grip and for some reason you can tell when the products really mesh together like i've said in my last video is when you don't have an issue with beading or just like the products not really flowing together and these two products do like so you won't have that issue if you do decide to give this a try hopefully you guys are liking my content so far i'm trying to be work on being consistent and showing up for my platform like i'm really trying so hopefully you guys can see that you know your girl is trying to do her best so now i'm just taking just a little bit of the benefit cosmetics brow setter this is like their brow setting gel and i really do like this gel because it really locks your brows in and you see at the front like i'm trying to create like well it's already i didn't feel in the front of my brow so it's giving like a more you know natural hair like vibe in the front as you can see so next i'm gonna set my face um set all of that work that i just put in i'm gonna set it with some setting spray i'm actually gonna be using the milk makeup hydro this is their grip set refresh spray that's a lot of that's a lot of information but this is what it looks like if you have not tried this ignore my nails y'all let's go get it i'm getting them done tomorrow and i'm actually gonna take you guys with me i'm gonna try to take you guys with me when i get my nails done so you should be seeing that video on sunday at 1 p.m that's what we're shooting for um so yeah so i'm just gonna spray this on my face and you should shake it up a little bit because it has some type of green green stuff at the bottom so you want to make sure that you get everything okay so i'm just going to spray this and set the face before we get started so now we're going to go ahead and move into foundation um the foundation that i've been loving is the anastasia luminous foundation i pretty much use this in every video um so i'm going to be mixing this today with the laura mercier foundation Now we're gonna just go ahead and start blending. So I'm gonna take my Sigma Flat Kabuki brush. This is the F80 brush. If you have not tried Sigma's uh, brushes, they do have really, really good brushes. They are a little bit on the pricey side, but they're really good brushes. Um, so that's why I'm taking to just blend out the foundation. And I feel so good, you guys, because I'm filming early. So that's a plus. That's why it's a little bit brighter. The sun is actually going down because it's like, I think it's, it's 3.30. And y'all know it get dark at like 5 o'clock. I hate that. And I'm so glad the time is going to be changing back soon because I hate the fact that it gets dark at like 2 o'clock. But y'all know what I mean. It gets dark, dark super early. Um, so I'm just going to take a little bit more foundation because y'all know I am what full coverage okay we don't like none of them little blemishes to be showing and then i'm just going to be blending it out again with this uh sigma flat kabuki brush just blending 
and really getting the product into the skin so it can get a flawless beat okay guys so now that we have the foundation blended move into concealer so i'm gonna use the makeup forever this is their matte velvet skin conceal concealer i don't like the applicator that's on the um the concealer so i actually just use a brush to apply it because that way i can get like a smooth even um amount of coverage because with the brush i feel like it it still picks up a lot of product um and doesn't really put a lot on your face focusing on this area because i have like a little blemish and comment below let me know like what type of coverage do you like are you more of a full coverage type of girl are you more of a full coverage type of girl or do you like you know just something light like a quick light beat because i'm like a full on if i'm either i'm beat beat or i'm just not beat at all like i'm just <laughs> looking bummy it's one of the it's no in between for me like so say if my friends they're like hey let's go somewhere let's get something to eat okay first of all where are we going because that's gonna dictate if i'm putting on makeup and then if we're going somewhere where i need to put on makeup i can't do a 10 minute light beat like i don't know what's wrong with me but i just can't do it like i tried i've tried y'all but it's just like uh, uh as soon as i get started i'm just like you know that was cute and all but i'm about to really just go in on my face because while we're here I might as well so yeah I'm more of a full coverage type of girl do want to try like a no makeup makeup look on my channel because I've never done that before so let me know if you'll be interested in that type of content just to switch it up a bit and um, try something new because I've never tried that before this was too much you don't need this much concealer if you're following this tutorial girl you really don't need this much you don't I promise but I was being extra as you can see, like I'm basically got concealer all over my face, but that's neither here nor there. I'm gonna take the Milk Hydro Grip Setting Spray and I'm just gonna spray my face again, just to lock everything in so that when I blend, it's gonna be blended. And let me not forget, because I have to make sure that I put on my Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. This is another gem that you guys need to be, you know, getting because who wants the ashy lips? Like, let's just go ahead and put this on right now. I got mine from um, Marshalls but you can get it from sephora but in sephora you're gonna pay twenty dollars i got mine for 12 or 14 but it's so worth it i'm gonna take my um sonia Kashuk beauty sponge and blend the rest of the face out Now I'm going back in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills foundation stick and I'm just going to contour the sides of my face and then my nose as well. You know, we got to get the nose snatched. And I hope that the lighting isn't changing y'all because it's getting closer to four o'clock. So y'all know that when the time changes, it's like getting darker by the second. So now that I have my face concealed and contoured, I'm gonna go ahead and move into setting. So um, I think today I'm gonna actually use the Laura Mercier. I feel like I'm using all Laura Mercier. Laura Mercier, hey girl, if you're trying to sponsor your girl, you know where to find me. Um, but I'm gonna take the Laura Mercier Translucent Honey. Y'all hear my dog? I can't make this up. Literally, I'm minding my business. I can't make this up. You guys know, make sure that you blend under your eyes before you put any type of powder because it's gonna lock in whatever you put in, okay? My eye has been running. You see this? I'm going to fix my eye situation, then I'm going to come back. Because at this point, listen, 
Okay guys, so now that we have that finished, we have our face all set. For you guys know, I I can't talk about this enough. This is the Black Radiance uh, True Complexion Contour Powder. I'm gonna take this and contour the sides of my face um, using my um, Anastasia A23 brush. So now I'm gonna cut my cheeks just a little bit more using that same Laura Mercier powder. I'm gonna go in with my Anastasia eye primer. I'm just gonna put this on the lids of my eye because I think I'm gonna do a little bit of a shimmer, not nothing too crazy. I'm going to apply it using this um, concealer brush that I use from ColourPop and I'm just lightly applying it to my lid. Now I'm gonna go in into my contour kit to up, warm everything up before I apply my shimmer shade. So I'm blending everything up into the brow as well. And then blending outward. So I'm gonna go into the Anastasia Jackie Aina palette. I'm gonna go into Dwalas. Dwalas, honey. Because that's what we want in 2021. We want Dwalas, okay? Give me the dollars. So I'm just gonna take this. This is really pretty. And I'm gonna spray my finger because I'm applying it with my finger. If you ever find that a shimmer shadow does not show up the way you're wanting it to, you can definitely use your finger because it's just gonna make it pop a lot more. So I'm also taking the same brush that I used before like to warm up the lid and I'm going into credit just a little bit and I'm going to warm up the lid using that shade and going around like the shimmer. Go back in and touch up the rest of my brows. And then we're going to finish out the look with the lashes. I think they discontinued this brush. This is the MAC 208 brush. Best brush, if you're looking for a brush to like apply your um, brows and stuff like that, best brush hands down. I think the 200, 208, something like that. But yeah, it's fire. It's given. The face is snatched, okay? Now I'm gonna go in and apply my liner. I'm probably gonna do that off camera and then I'm gonna come back with my liner and lashes on. And then we're gonna close out the look. So just stay tuned, sis. So we applied the lashes, we did the liner. Um, now we're just gonna move into blush. I'm taking the Becca Blush Trio palette using Songbird in the middle. And I'm applying this to my cheek. Now I'm gonna go ahead and use and line my lips. Um, using the cork lip liner by Mac I'm just adding um, this is undressed by Anastasia in the middle Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this nice bronzy glam. Okay, we got into it. If you did enjoy this video, girl, make sure that you leave some comments in the comment section, okay? Because I would love to chat it up with you. And also, if you're new to my channel, make sure that you subscribe before leaving. Make sure that you set your notifications so that you won't miss a slay with your girl, Chelsea J. I love you all so much, and I can't wait to see you in my next video.